At Exeter Chamber, we think it's really important that we encourage people to travel more sustainably, particularly now after everything that's happened over the last 18 months. There's a real opportunity for us to change the way we move. And we're coming up to COP26. Uh, we've got World Car Free Day on the 22nd of September. And obviously people have seen their working patterns change quite substantially over the last year or so. So people may opt to come into the office so often, they're working from home more often. And the great thing about working with the bus company at Stagecoach is we can start to promote to them about the more flexible ways they can travel. For example, using Stagecoach's carnet of tickets, so they only need to use a ticket whenever they travel rather than feeling like they've wasted their travel. I was actually there that day with my other hat on, which is work, working for co-cars and co-bikes. Um, it was an amazing day. I don't think any of us could have asked for a better occasion to launch the bus station, apart from the fact it was unbelievably hot, as anyone who was there will testify. Uh, but it was great to be able to show off this development to a member of the Royal Family. He was really engaged with everything and all the net zero activities that are happening across the city. The bus station, with the services that we deliver for co-cars and co-bikes, with uh, Exit City Futures, Exit City Council, it was just brilliant to have all the partners in the same space and really be able to showcase the amazing things we're doing as Exeter. So since the bus station launched we've received incredible feedback from our passengers. Passengers no longer need to wait in the elements, we're completely enclosed with automatic doors allowing you to stay warm and dry when you're waiting for the bus. It's, it's a real vast difference from the station that they were used to travelling in and the feedback has been amazing. From a chamber perspective, it's absolutely amazing to see the city centre transformed in this way. The new bus station really adds a whole different dimension to the space. Um, that plus St Sibyl's Point opening behind has just created a different character to the place. And it's just really exciting to see the future in the city now.